Now, your 13 first alert weather forecast. Most of the area did wake up to some snow on the ground this morning, which was a reminder to us that yes, it is indeed still winter as it certainly hasn't felt or even looked like it lately. Uh, from there, we did enjoy a good deal of sunshine throughout the day, and I'm happy to say the weather is going to stay dry into this evening. For now, we are under a mainly clear sky, but we do have some cloud cover off to the west, and eventually at least some of that is going to increase uh, through parts of western Wisconsin as those temp temperatures do start to drop down through the 20s. As we take a live look from our Nicolay Bank Phoenix Park Sky Camp from this vantage point, we do have a blue sky out there, lots of sunshine to enjoy, and temperatures running much closer to average for this time of year. In fact, we're right around average in Eau Claire, 27 degrees the current temperature. But if you step outside, you'll notice it feels colder, our wind chill at 17, and that's because we do have a west wind currently at 12 miles per hour. Across the state, all of us pretty much in the same boat, ranging from the 20s north into the 30s further south. Uh, 28 right now in Wisconsin Rapids, 34 in the cross, 34 as well down in Prairie du Chien. And we're not really seeing a warm spot on the regional picture here. Yes, some 40s off to the south, but outside of that, uh, most of us hanging out into the 20s. And you'll see here across southern Canada, uh, we do have some pockets of teens, even single digit temperatures. And that's what we're going to get into later on tonight, depending on how much of that cloud cover does overspread the area. By tomorrow morning, you'll definitely want to have that heavy coat on hand as we are going to be waking up with temperatures uh, mostly into the teens and there's not going to be very much improvement throughout the day as we now have at least some snowpack in place and with a continued northwesterly flow that is going to be, uh, be breezy that's going to bring more of that colder Canadian air down to us as you can see tomorrow afternoon uh, most spots struggling to get out of the upper teens, but there will be some improvements as we head into this weekend. As mentioned, off to our west across the Dakotas, down in Nebraska, we do have some cloud cover that is coming with a bit of snowfall, but I do expect things to stay dry here locally. We have that broad northwesterly flow helping to bring in that colder air, and there is a front off to the north, but again, not really too impactful to our weather. So while we have the mainly clear sky for now, later on tonight, you'll start to see some of these clouds inching in from the west. Those will be around periodically through the overnight hours. Otherwise, for tomorrow, we'll have some clouds around, but that does look to come with quite a bit of sunshine throughout the day, a dry into the work week, and not much to track even going into tomorrow night. Uh, we'll have variable cloud cover, and then on Saturday, we do turn partly to mostly cloudy throughout the day, and it does look to stay quiet into the start of the weekend. So for tonight, a chilly one out there. Our low temperature bottoms out at around 13 degrees. For tomorrow, we're only up to around 19 in Eau Claire. Northwest winds at 10 to 17 miles per hour. And temperatures uh, after tomorrow do start to climb near, if not above average, uh, through the 30s this weekend. And the forecast is going to be dry even in the next week. There are no 13 first alert weather days in sight as we are just going to be in a mundane pattern here. 30 on Saturday, 36 on Sunday. Going into next week, that's the return of the 40s, and we're kissing that snowpack goodbye, <laughs> as some of us could be working our way towards 50 by the midweek. Wow, that's just, just again, crazy for this time of year. Yeah, I mean, we're in February. It's one of our colder months, and here we are back yeah. into the 40s and 50s. Just crazy. Yeah, going into the latter half of February now. Yeah, and uh, March 1st, meteorological spring. So All there right. you go. There you go. Thanks, Derek. Mm -hmm. The latest entertainment news is up next.